Hey everyone, Meosity here, welcome back. Today we're going to be going back into the Warpstone Mines on our Darkest Dungeon modded file. Thought we'd have a little fun going back into it with another bleeding party because that seemed to do really well in there. So we'll see how it works. A uh, fair warning that I did have to turn tutorials back on for the Black Reliquary file and it seems to have crossed over to this file and I don't want to turn it off just because I'm going to forget to turn it back on if I do that. So some tutorials may pop up. I probably will just be dismissing them unless it is something related to the Warpstone Mines, the Sunward Isles, Pet Cemetery, or something that I don't have memory of doing. But yeah, fair warning that uh, tutorials probably will be popping up because they were reset. Um, but that is why that is happening. But we will be going into the Warpstone Mines with a lot of modded classes once again. Just seeing how this does. Uh, and seeing if we can't find anything else. And as I said, things are popping up. As you can see, the blood. Uh, we won't be needing that. We won't be needing anything on the provisionaries. But we will be taking torches. Uh, since this is Warpstone Mines, where is that? Now, I did take some notes from the last time I was in here. So I will be taking a bit of anti-venom. Uh, some shovels. I do want to see what this does. So I'm going to be taking this. In worst case scenario, I take it back with me. Take some medicinal herbs, some bandages, and a few keys. And for now, I'm going to call it that. And if I don't find any uses for the medicinal herbs or the bandages, Next time I'm going to bring holy water and lot on them, however you want to pronounce that, and we'll see if there's uses for those. Hopefully I'm not forgetting anything. This is a short, so I think I have enough supplies otherwise. Oh, that is interesting. Barricades are strictly monitored installments. If you stall without demolishing them, it will invite reinforcements. Right, since we're exploring 90% of the rooms, we're going to go right. Mutated? What is that? Oh, that is the uh, third hand one. <laughs> so I think that's the... Yeah, that, that is plus stress, but she also gets plus max HP, which could be interesting. Nothing here, but very cool background. Wish I could have interacted with that a little bit more, but that's fine. And down we go. All right. Interesting that they want to eat already. Wealth beyond measure. We will take that and, and the fool uh, that's kleptomaniac, right. isn't it? Not oh, that's kleptomaniac and curious. I'm gonna have to do some work on that Lamia. All right, let's dig through this. Oh, what is it with this party? All right, first little bit of fun. They are surprised, so we can take them out. Um, I am just going to allure the shield rat there, or the shield bearer, so we can crit it more. Uh, for now, I am just going to adapt so we can bleed. And we're going to Eye Thief. And I have to remember her moves really quick. I don't want to move her forward, so we actually, it doesn't matter with the Ranger there. So we're going to Blood in the Water and get a Striker. Ooh, that accuracy. Uh, bloodshed Claws. Really, with that accuracy. <laughs> oh, 
Wow. <laughs> gonna have to heal. She's stunned so she can't do anything. All right, um, I'm not gonna be able to hit the clan rat striker so let's just adapt and then get accuracy down for now. With flurry. Yikes. Yikes. That's the one I wanted to get. Blood in the water. Let's get the halberdier then. I'm going to reel them in. Hopefully killing the halberd ear. Healing so we don't bleed. Ah, uh, da da da. Let's stun him. Oh, that didn't do what I thought it would. Darn. Should have read that a little bit more. Did he just... Oh, that was the corpse. Okay. They're a little more vicious than I remember them being last time. Alright, this time we can get to the bleeder, so I'm going to gouge. Forgot he was guarding. Uh, healing the Kraken Slayer. Bloodshed Claws. Werewolf gets me every time with some of those comments. Alright, we are going to reel them in so that she can finish that person next turn. Savage Feast to heal up. Give them no quarter. And that one is actually gonna die next turn, so let's heal again. And it goes down. Okay. There we go. This expedition at least promises. My mouse stops messing up. We can move on. All right, rattling gunner and the poison wind glob deer. So what I'm actually gonna do is get the accuracy down on the poison wind. this thing. I love it. Um, we're going to get him bleeding. Bloodshed claws. Heal up. on its own. Alright, what is next? Let's get that stress down. I probably should heal a bit more, but I think we're okay doing that. Let's get the clan rat there bleeding if I can.
bloodshed claws again. Then the Kraken Slayer can do the kill. Take it out. And we got these two left. Then, once again, healing up, going for the Lamia. She's a little low for comfort. Uh, let's get his accuracy down. Blood in the water. He bleeds out on next turn, so I can go for the Halberd Deer. Or, you know, just AoE Bloodshed Claws. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. All well Alright, this isn't too bad. So let's adapt to gouge. And there we go. More warp stone. Something for the vessel. Not a victory. Gold chance on kill. Interesting. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. Sure, let's burn it. Yes, I know about the torch. Slave rats this time, huh? All right, let's take the chance to heal up. I thief. Blood vision. I uh, don't want to blood in the water. You want to skewer, and we're gonna hit him. Is broken. Maintain the Bloodshed claws. Hopefully, get them bleeding. Uh oh. As life ebbs, terrible vistas of emptiness reveal themselves. Okay, that's the heal that gets rid of the corpse. Interesting that they can use that without an action. Accuracy on this team is not the greatest. Alright, so just so we... Wait, I can use... What's the buff? Blight chance and stun chance. Okay, so that's not the greatest. I was wondering what it did. Right, so we're going to adapt into Gouge and hopefully take out the plan rat so or Slave Rat Soldier, rather. Destroy. Then we're going to Blood in the Water. Actually, no. We're going to reel him in. Kill. It's another one down. Savage feast. And gouge. There we go. Be wary. Triumphant. Let's default party order. A dizzying fall. Uh, how much food do I have? Yeah, I don't think it's safe to use that. I am going to go down. Medicinal herbs. Regeneration. The 
Oh, the collector is here, huh? Twisted. And he's surprised. This might be interesting. So let's up our crit rate on him. I'm gonna reel him in. The ground quakes. So she's back there. And that also dodge and speed down. We are going to adapt. And then this will be minus accuracy and bleeding on him. Wish I had a way of stunning him, but... That is fine. I'm gonna have her hang. Actually, no. We're gonna take out the man at arms. Unfortunately, he was not bleeding, so it doesn't do too much, but I have a plan. I adapt into Flurry, getting their accuracy down. Bloodshed Claws, hopefully getting them bleeding. Healing up just in case. Adapt. Let's get the vessel bleeding, or vestal. Reel them in. can focus on the collector. A little bit of a setup there, but I think I'm good. Alright, bloodshed claws. We're gonna heal the falconeer. We are going to gouge because he is bleeding. Bloodshed Claws again. He's bleeding for seven. He's not doing too good, but the kill might do the trick. There we go. Oh, you prick. Oh, that wasn't what I thought it was. The slow death. Unforeseen. Unforeseen. Blood in the water. Just making sure. And Puzzling Trapezohedron. Let's use one of those bandages just to be safe and move on along. And I'm out of torches. Lovely. Well, I suppose it could be worse. Really? At least she resisted. All right, Falconeer. Yes. Working journal. Working journal. And let's go to the quick one. And then from there we can decide if we want to go up or not. Dark 
Darkness closes in, haunting the heart. Did you really steal my heirlooms? Warp fire thrower. Alright, well, lower that accuracy. Healing up. Bloodshed claws. No bleed. Die, die. <laughs> oh, man. Oh! It was a blight fire. Interesting. Alright, let's skewer. He bleeds, he dies. Okay. Let's get rid of some stress. Um, yeah, we'll bleed the clan rat. Oh, that is not good. A hand's breadth from becoming unwound. I reel him in. Bloodshed claws. Hoping to do something here. She is so close so often. Depending upon how this goes. Alright. <laughs> if the Lamia didn't go then, that could have been it. We're going in for the kill. Bloodshed Claws. Really? However, that being said, Adapt Gouge. I think we're good. Then I have the anti-venom and I don't think I'm going to keep going after this room so we're safe to use these. Alright, unless I get a scout. Nope, okay. Well that was much harder and much more dangerous than the last one. It might have been the fact that the healer was a little uh, riskier, but or it might have just been my accuracy right in the beginning and from things going downhill like that. So, but we did get through it. We did get a piercing pendant for the Hellion. Like how they repurposed that one. Uh, 11,000 gold, some heirlooms. Everyone hit, or we did hit a level two, not everyone hit level two. Phantasmophobia, Stress Eater, and we do have to do a little working on that Lamia to make her actually useful. <laughs> the poor caretaker. I fear his long standing. Alright, do I have a living one of those guys? That is the question. Because I know I had one at one point. I do not, it looks like. So we'll, we'll figure out which one's the more. Actually, I might not have room. Um, unlikely allies. Cloaked figures approach a hamlet. While at first they seem of malicious intent, their animacy to join the endeavor dissuades judgment. With that being said, can I even uh, upgrade the hero barracks? I cannot. Yeah, we might be able to. So hero barracks, More and let's get one of them. Seeking I like the uh, in this domain of the damned forsaken here. They can be kind of fun. So rat hater and sunward explorer, but bull step. Ooh, and light sensitive or manslayer and steady in dark temptation. I'll take the second one. And then in the stagecoach, we have an Omen Seeker, which I don't think I have one of a live. I know I had one during like the uh, period where I was trying to get things set up, but they died. Do I have a Jester? Jesters are fun. Do not have a Jester. Let's get one of those. And I have a Martyr and an Exorcist, so I'm going to lay off on those. Some people de-stressing. 
because that's going to be very necessary. And just keep kind of plugging away at the pet cemetery and the Morpstone mines, I think, is going to be the plan. At some point, I may have to keep going into the ruins to get a blueprint, I think, because at some point I would really like to get a few things just to make things easier. But until I have level three heroes, that's not going to be too big of a concern because I'm not going to be able to do what I want to do. Even if I like have the resources to get the I think it's the bank I really wanted to get so I can get the skills upgraded really easily. So that's kind of what I'm thinking is just kind of keep plugging away at the Warpstone Mines and Pet Cemetery as I can for now. Um, kind of change my plan a little bit. The Hamlet's kind of getting upgraded. I'm kind of getting used to some of these heroes and I'm still collecting a few of them. And it's kind of looking like I'm only going to have room for one of each hero. I might have a little bit more room to have um, two of a few of them I really like. But I'm not entirely sure of that uh, with how big the stagecoach mod I have is. And then from there, we can kind of figure out a few other things. So that's going to be kind of what I have in mind. Um, probably going back into the Warpstone Mines next time. <laughs> I know that there, the werewolf's accuracy is kind of junk as is sometimes, but... It might be nice to have a thing giving them even more damage, so I'm going to maybe try to get that and see what I can do from there. I'm just not sure the party I'm going to bring in yet, so I will figure that out. And in the meantime, I wish you all well. I'll see you next time, and please have a good one.